Well, hello YouTube land. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good night, wherever you are in the world and whatever time you're watching. It is an absolutely glorious day, as you can see. The sun is out. Hello sun, nice to see you for a change. Today we are going for a little ride, not only because we desperately need some fuel, well not that desperately but sort of, kind of, never mind. We are going to play with some RC trucks. I've just finished one, I've been building up, putting electrics in and all that kind of stuff. So we're going to go and play with them. I've also yet again changed my microphone position just a little bit, I've moved it up. So I don't know if that's going to be better or worse, but we will see. I've got the little hero session mounted down there again. Although it's still flapping around, I actually, the previous video to this, if I end up uploading it, um, I expected the footage to be much worse, I've got to be honest. It actually came out okay. The, it wasn't the vibrations as such that were bad because of the four mounts. The vibrations per se weren't that bad. The worst part of it was actually more the wind hitting it, I think, and bumps in the road and such, and that was actually more of the movement. I've run some stabilization software or whatever you want to call it. Um, and it actually improved it quite a lot. So I'm, I'm quite happy with that. So I've just actually ordered the Joby, um, the suction cup, and then the arm, um, oh, I've forgotten what the arm's called. I'll probably put a link in the description for you or, or a picture up on screen or whatever, just so you can see what it is. Um, and it's basically an arm that's got a ball on each end and it's got the threads on the end for putting your cameras and things on. So you stick one part of it to the, to your surface you put your camera on the other side and you can set it in different positions in in quarter of a turn of the of the tightening screw thumb screw whatever you want to call it so i'm looking forward to that because it looks a lot more steady than that the only flex coming through that is actually in the arm itself it's twisting because it's only a cheap arm it was about four or five quid on ebay it was not much it was just a test the job we set up should be a lot better um i'm hoping so we'll see because it shouldn't have the sort of the, the twisting flex. I think it's because it's got the grooves cut out of it that's the worst bit. Um, it's kind of hard to see. Uh, I tried to show you a bit there, but it's it's got like grooves cut out all over the sides, and I think that's what's creating the flex. Presumably, just less materials. It's a bit cheaper to make. I don't know, but so fingers crossed, the Joby one will be good. That should be here in the next few days. There's one thing I will say about editing footage from two separate cameras is getting all the audio and everything in sync, that's quite difficult. I was actually looking at investing in some kind of, um, like an external microphone recorder, then when I moved to the footage from the Hero Session on the, on the side of the bike, I can go to the external audio, but I'm not sure which external audio recorder to go with. I've obviously got my own microphone for the GoPro, but that's not, although is it an external mic, it's not an audio recorder. It's still, the camera still only records the external audio. Suppose this is a little test of what the new positioning of the mic is like with my visor wide open. And I've got a new mascot as well. That little dude. I, heard, I felt some inside, but there wasn't really much about what it did on the label. I thought it was just like a rubbery thing, but it's actually if you if you flick it, you won't see it in this in this light. But he actually flashes. I might put a little clip of him flashing up as well, just because I can't get one right now. So yeah, going back to what I was saying about the external like sound recorder and that, if anyone knows of a decent one that isn't. A massive amount of money. I'd appreciate some input if you could just leave a quick comment or send me a message or whatever you prefer. I'm actually on Instagram now as well. Um, I'll put that on the screen probably. So yeah, I could be contacted there as well if you prefer. What a nice day. That's not a bad view. 
for just basic standard fields and a, a bit of a hill, it's quite nice to look at. come back that way actually you viewers need to remind me hopefully I'll remember yeah Woo! Woo -hoo! I'm a bit giddy today asshole bye bye No, don't leave. I'm flat out of the wind is holding me back. No. Watch him forgot to forget to turn off. That would be hilarious. Oh he hasn't. That would have been some like sort of sweet payback for, for leaving me behind. <laughs> Mascot still in tow. Perfect. <laughs> There's that sheep in my helmet again. Thought it was warm and fluffy in here. <laughs> that sounds nice popping away. We have a winner. What a day. Lovely. Not too hot, but it's just nice and, and bright and be just a nice road for the hero session this one I get, might get some nice views along here you might not but you might do
I love this bit of road. Nice if it was closed though, and you could come on and just have a bit of fun with no worry about slowing down for cars coming towards you, like this one. Thank you, sir. Look at that for a view. Beautiful. That's awesome. I'm gonna do it. Unfortunately. There we go, I did a little bit. <laughs> oh that was good fun. Oh yeah. What is that big chunk of plastic still in the road like I almost hit the other night? coming down here and there were some people walking so I went just slightly into the other lane and ended up almost in a chunk up it looked like a car front splitter across that other lane I imagine a car will have hit it and moved it by now though where was it? it was just here somewhere no it's obviously gone no no it's gone come on mate Take off? Yeah. <laughs> Did it? No. Well, I will end today's video here because we're near, not too far off home now. Um, please subscribe to the channel. I'm trying to sort of build it up and get some subs and get some views and that, that kind of thing. So please subscribe and feel free to share it if you enjoyed it. Hit the like button, leave a comment, all that stuff, and we'll see you on the next one.